Welcome to Somewhat Awesome Games. Good looking people, I'm Rob. We are playing Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. I hope you guys had a good weekend. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed our uh, previous Animal Crossing video. But today is a special day. Today is the day we've all been waiting for. Me especially. And I'm sure you have too. Look at all this. Look at this. I've been trying to play this over the weekend, but we've had such a ridiculous weekend. It was so busy. And... Uh, I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. I tried to pick up this game as much as I could, but I didn't. I didn't have much time. I hit a few cycles, but I missed most of them. Majority of them. I hit like a quarter of the cycles over the weekend. It was terrible. Disgraceful. I'm ashamed. Why you're even still watching this, I don't even know. But we're almost level 50, as you can see. And we have quite a few animals to invite. And thank these guys, Makar and uh, Vink Murphy and Kyle, for buying some of my items that I have... Uh, Managed to stock. I did a terrible job for so long was this market just empty just disgraceful a terrible salesman I am uh, we got bells for our login and two ten bells people didn't hit up Their uh, quarry do we have to have I sent out invites? I don't think I have I think I missed the invites I gotta get that done. I gotta do my invites god damn it But we're at the beach. Let's go outside Let's actually, let's see what we got completed. We, oh, we made a cat scratching post. We've been hitting up some of the animals' uh, personal crafting requests. So we got a cat tower. Hooray for us. Uh, judging by the size of the cats in this world, that cat tower should be gigantic, right? That should be like the size of a two-story house. But it's going to be tiny. We all know it's going to be tiny. But realistically, it should be enormous. Look at this. It's a harpsichord made out of paintings beautiful man I'm pretty sure that's for Goldie and we can invite these guys in I think the only guy we can't invite in is freaking Rattle man Rattle don't want to come yet we gotta get him to level 7 damn it Rattle everyone else can be invited in and craft wise we are crafting the stage so you missed out I apologize you missed out on seeing the unveiling of the carousel but that is done so our cute characters can go to level 20 and once this stage is done, all our characters can go to level 20. And then we can just level these up. We'll start with a tree house and get this maxed. We have 36 natural essence, 12 cute essence. We can just switch up our campsite and bring in cute characters. And you get, you get so much essence. Honestly, putting characters of a certain type into your campsite for essence you want, you get so much. If you hit every hour, you'll be laughing. You'll be like, ah ha ha, I have 30 at the end of the day. I know some people say, you gotta go to the quarry, man. You gotta go to the quarry. Get that essence from the quarry. Yeah, I got five essence from a quarry. That's like you talk to two animals. You could get that. Here it is. Holy biscuits. Look at this place. There is snow. It's snowing. It's finally starting to look a lot like Christmas. My guy's in his pajamas. Let's catch a fish for us. There's probably a flounder. Oh, it's a snapper. I'm surprised. How is everyone's animal game going? How are you guys going? No one's sick of this shit? I hope not. Uh, I had a blast last time we made a video. I actually had a lot of fun making that video. Just, I, I like this game because even though we're all Animal Crossing fans, we're playing the game, uh, you all have a basic understanding of this game that I don't really need to be like, right now I'm gonna go pick up this bit of coral and I'm gonna run over here. I'm going to tap the screen and catch this fish. Ooh, I wonder what fish it could be. We all know it's probably gonna be a squid, right? Like, I don't have to dumb it down and pretend I'm an idiot. Look at that. Was, was anyone surprised that that was a squid? No! Uh, so I like doing these videos, because it's just kind of like a... Uh, I'm, I'm treating them more while we're playing the game. And while uh, you guys have pointed out that a lot of you guys play this while watching this, treating it more like a, uh, a podcast. The drinks have changed. Didn't they used to be like cocktails or something? Now they're little cups of, uh, I'm going to say hot chocolate, just because that feels very Christmassy. Except in Australia, where it's 40 degrees Celsius, so hot chocolates are like, I no, give me something made of ice, damn it. Look at that. Look how chilled out we are. We've got some lady in her ice jumper with a Christmas dress. How much inventory space we got? How are we going here? I'm trying to keep at least 10 of everything. Not bad, we've got one shell. Quite a lot of, a few things actually, too many. I cleared out all my bugs and stuff. I've got one of every rare creature 
minus the ones that animals actually want, like the, the bass, the beetle, and the snapper. Everything else, I, I dumbed it down to one, because they're just a waste of space. I made some good bells off them, but overall a waste of space. I thought about putting them into my market, which is not a terrible idea, but I was like, nah, who's going to buy it? If I see rare stuff like that, I'm not going to buy it. What? We're full? What? I didn't even check the inventory space. I was just here. Let's chuck out oranges. I'm going to say chuck out. Let's sell some oranges. Sell three. You know I love my three for 230. Sell that out. Uh, but yeah, I'm treating this more like a podcast in a way. Just the visuals are not important. Except in this case, because it's snowing. Look at the snow. It's so nice. It's so good. It's about damn time, right? Uh, but yeah, I just, I just like talking. I don't have to describe what I'm doing. Does anyone actually care? Does anyone actually really care about what I'm doing? Does anyone watch this and go, Ooh, we caught a snapper. Ooh, we caught a squid. We've all done that. You're, you can catch your own squids and stuff. Trying to keep it interesting, but at the same time, last time we talked about friends, Phoebes and stuff. I enjoy that. I enjoy just ranting, raving, going on about things that have no nothing to do with Animal Crossing. All right. No, oh, no. All right, let's, let's stock our marker. I think it's time. We stock our market. When is our cycle ticking over? In 52 minutes. I missed the morning. I missed two cycles this morning. No, I missed one cycle. I missed the 7.30 to 10.30 cycle. I'm ashamed. I'm going to sell some shells. She sells seashells by the seashore. Look at that. Nailed it, man. All that speech therapy paid off. Beautiful work there, Rob. Right? What sell we shell? Nah, see, I blew it. Damn it. I need to go back. I'm gonna say what? What? Oh man! After saying she sells seashells by the seashore, it turns out saying what shall we sell is the tongue twister. We created our own accidental tongue twister. What shall we sell? What? What shall we sell? There we go. That's the next addition to that. She she sells seashells by the seashore. What shall we shell? See, I can't say sell at the end of it. I say shell. What shall, what shall we shell? It's crazy. Try it out. Give it a go. We just invented a tongue twister. See, the video has changed the world already. We created a tongue twister that follows on from she, she sell, see sell. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. It's appalling. It's appalling. She, she sells seashells by the seashore. What shall we sell? God damn. That's... How about that, huh? How about that? Let's go talk to some animals here. Look at the snow. I c oh, I haven't even seen my... Look at my little footprints. I need little footprints because I'm not wearing shoes. That's amazing. That's the that's the highlight of my game. I can, I can now stop playing. I've seen everything I wanted to see. Can I write my name? Let's see. Let's give it an R. Ah. Close enough. Let's give it an O. Close enough. Let's give it a B. Not even close. Terrible. Cherry, what's up, man? Miss, ma'am, how we doing? We got Cherry and we got Cherry the dog. Cherry's everywhere. Cherry with a Y and Cherry with an I. Have some fish. What do you want butterflies? Have some fish anyway. There's not butterflies in there. I gave you a bag of fish. Whenever I want to test my latest choreography in front of an audience, I just know what to do. Bring in the bugs, tra la 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 Now I'll have you know, they give surprising insightful feedback. Oh god, you gonna dance for me? Oh, you're singing! This is not choreography! Not only are we, you know, have the bugs lived in my pocket, we've now put them in a container and are torturing them with music that's obviously terrible. I'm not saying, you know, not obviously terrible, but a high probability that we're doing terrible. I don't want to diss like, I don't want someone at Nintendo watching this who, like, did the music for this game and being like, ouch, man, I'm a professional. I just meant in the, in the spirit of the world, Cherry looking at her is probably, you know, a try-hard pop singer who would sing a song about anything. You know, you could be singing Piano Man where they'd be like, Sing us a song, you're the piano man. And she'd be like, Sing us a song, you're the piano man. You can just tell that's the type of singer she is. You don't want to be that girl. If it's a word, you know, just just give it one. Just give it one uh, syllable and be done with it. 
Don't drag it out for the rest of us, goddammit. How do we have so much stuff in our inventory, yet the only one who wants any of it is this little freaky frog with a duck face? Why are you disappointing me? Why are you doing this to me, the game? Look at my little footprints. It's snowing. It's a good day. It's a nice day. I can't wait to see my campsite in the snow. Let's go. Let's go help out Tad. What's up, Tad? You want some uh, pale chubs? I can give you some of them. I'll give you some pale chubs. We need to thin down our inventory. Stock up our market a bit. Be able to catch some more things. That's all I really want to do. So what I really, really want? What I really, really want. I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. Apparently this is the musical episode. I didn't know. I was unprepared. As a unprofessional singer, I was, uh... I'm as surprised as you are. I'm very surprised. We got tongue twisters, which I started out well at and gradually got worse at. To the point where I couldn't even speak English anymore. Which, I'm just as surprised as you. Uh, I'm sure you guys are going, hey... What are they speaking? They speak Australian in Australia, right? Not English. Uh, yeah, that's right. That's right. I'm speaking Australian right now. You buggery duggeries. I don't know what that means. No one says that here. I hope no one says that here. If they, if someone I knew said that to me, said buggery duggeries to me, uh, I probably wouldn't know them anymore. And they'd just walk away and be like, have a good life. Good luck with the rest of the year. What are you selling for me, Mr. Man? Mr. Squiggle? Got some good stuff. Got that... They're stuck in some solid stuff today. I don't know why I keep buying it because I, I don't have room for it. But I you're gonna see my mark my market box is gonna be full because I'm gonna buy all these people's things and I'm gonna sell it. They have a lot of shells though, which I don't know if you guys buy. Ah, oh, come on, ten coconuts is too many coconuts. What's up, Tad? You're number one, right? I get a man. Hey, working out much, slurp? See, this guy needs speech therapy because he's got that. He says slurp, or he's a terrible singer, and he's dragging out the syllable. Just say slurp. It doesn't have to be slurp. Just say it. Just say slurp. People are busy these days. They're too busy to hear longer words than they need to be. That's why we, like, you know, make words shorter. Dumb them down. Like, instead of saying, I'm going to McDonald's, we say, I'm going to Macca's. That's what we say here. I'm going to Macca's. Don't even say, I'm going, it's just going to Macca's. Not even to, not even T-O, just T. Just going, we drop the G, we have two, we drop the O, and just T, and then Macca's, we don't even say McDonald's, we drop it to Mac, and then just put A on the end. Macca's. Gone to Macca's. This is what it is. So, no one has time for slurp. It's like he's having a stroke or something. Hey, working out much? You need help? Shouldn't hit the gym so hard, man. It's not good for your heart. Or it is good for your heart. Unless you're injecting stuff in you. Which you shouldn't be, frog. You shouldn't be, man. It's not the way to do it, Tad. Earn your rewards. There's no shortcuts in life. Unless you're talking about, like, Mario Kart and stuff, like road related things like oh we could go the long way or we could take the shortcut in which case like that there are shortcuts because you get places quicker but in general in life in general there are no shortcuts so don't do steroids that's the lesson today don't extend your words and don't do steroids don't sing like a pop star where should we go now no what do you guys actually want what do you want what do you want bear Horse mackerel. Of course, you want horse mackerel too. You want beetles. I had beetles. I don't have any more. You want horse mackerels. Alright, my camps have been not let me down. Don't let me down. You horse mackerels. Beetles. Beetles. I have absolutely everything. Everything. I've pale chubs. I've got yellow perch. Butterflies. Squids. Crucian cups. Flounders. All the fruits. The two things I don't have, the game goes, you know what would be pretty good? If we make every request in this cycle be the two items he has zero of. He has way too much of everything else, but he doesn't have these two items. Let's make him waste his time, waste his hard-earned time. I don't know what hard-earned time is, but that sounds like I'm in prison. Uh, waste his time catching beetles and fish 
Why can't these guys, why can't you, someone just here to sell them to me? Someone here sell me horse mackerels and fruit beetles. What was our friend selling over here? He was just selling coconuts and shells, wasn't he? He was, look at you, why are so many butterflies? Why are all the butterflies? Now you're just teasing me. You're like, ah, ha, ha, ha. Have 20 butterflies in your inventory. You'll keep catching them because you're addicted. You just got coconuts, all right? I don't have enough room to buy them, do I? Because you're selling 10 at a time. Do I have room? Do I actually have room? What? What? Let's put them in the market. Let's sell them. Let's put them in the market. Coconuts. Away you go. We've got 29 coconuts. If anyone ever says to you, how many coconuts is too many coconuts? The answer is 29. Let's drop it down. Three by three by three. If anyone is looking for coconuts, I have a good feeling that no matter what time of day you check my market box in the next like 48 hours, there will be coconuts. And you know what? No one ever needs coconuts. There's way too many coconuts in this game. And now there's way too many coconuts in my market that nobody is going to buy. None of you are going to buy these coconuts. Oh, I could fill every box with coconuts if I really wanted to. If I really wanted to be that guy, I could flood this market with coconuts. Actually, let's stock with some different fruit. Let's spice it up. Let's go with 21 peaches. That's way too many peaches. Even as a person who likes eating peaches, that's too many peaches. If Mel came home one day from the shops and said, Look, I got 21 peaches. I'd be like, why are you buying so many peaches? I might eat three a week. I'm not going to eat 21. They're going to go bad. That's dumb. Don't buy so many peaches next time. Now they're all moldy and gross and they're outside and the ducks are eating them. Which ain't a bad thing. I guess the ducks like peaches. I don't know. I've never given them peaches before. We should chuck some flounders in here too. Stocking it up. Stocking it up. Pears, peaches, coconuts and flounders. That's what you've come here for. That's my new market name. Alright, that's enough. That's enough marketing, right? That's enough. Alright, cool. Let's go to our campsite. Because that's where you really want to see. There's nothing special. It's a little bit different, but it's nothing special. Hey, fruit beetle. Fruit beetles. The game came through. Look at that. Let's catch these fruit beetles first. Get them, man. Let's get them. Are you guys ready for the New Year's event that will be coming up after Christmas? With, uh, what is it? New Year's ribbons or something? I don't know. I can't remember. But some kind of special item. I'm curious, though, as to whether... The New Year's item will be that day, or if we have like a, a week lead up. It's so like once Christmas ends, the new event will start and we'll have time to collect all these things. Or if it will be, well, you didn't play on New Year's, so you don't get the New Year's items. You better get some leaf tickets. I'm hoping, as, as a player, I'm hoping it's the week long New Year's event where we have time to collect the things like candy canes and craft whatever the new year's items are but as a business side i never feel the need to make spend money in this game so it would make way more sense let's go to the river let's go to the river we'll, we'll get to the campsite we'll build up to the campsite uh as a business it would make more sense to have it as a day and have everyone freaking out katakuing out i'm gonna call it that we all kataku out and buy leaf tickets we will see we will see. Look how nice the snow is. It's finally here. It's the 11th. That's what we've been waiting for. The season changes on the 11th. And here we go. We've got goddamn snow, man. It looks so Christmassy now. We have to see it at night. That's what we're waiting for. We have to do a night video and see Christmas at night with all the street lights and stuff in our camp. Yeah, clap it up, blue hair. Who we got here? I don't know. I don't know. I could try to pronounce it, but... It's probably insulting. I know there's looks like you've got some H's in there and some T's. Maybe an A. I don't know, man. Let's catch these beetles, man. Buy them beetles. This is exactly what I need. Except you need some horse mackerels, buddy. Give me some horse mackerels. I, got, I think I got too many yellow perches. Why am I buying all this stuff with you? I was good at someone's mark and I go, ooh, that's not full price. I buy it. Like an idiot. It could be like 10 cents less than full price or 10, dollars, 10 bells less than full price. And they're like, oh, that's a good deal. I'll buy that. I don't know why. I'm a dope. I'm, there you go. There's the answer. I'm a dope. What's up, piggy? 
Maggie. Here you go, I got some Beatles for you. I am the famous Rob. Didn't I lend you a book a while back, Shep? Ah, uh, here you go. Here's your book. It's a bug's life. You'd really give this to me? I must be the luckiest girl in the world. It's possible. It's possible, cheese head. Your head looks like cheese. Which is not a good thing, but it's not a bad thing. Oh, I reckon we could get you to level 13, which will... Ah, oh, no! Come on! Damn it! I take it back. You ain't getting to level 13. I'm never gonna talk to you again. Tell me about the marker box, as if I don't know. As if the people at home don't know about the marker box after I've just stocked it for 10 hours. Forget you, pig. Forget you. What we got in here? We're not gonna catch any horse macros in here. It's the wrong place. We need to go to the ocean. But we need to catch... Apparently we need what? We must need like 30 horse mackerels to complete this re request cycle. Everyone wants horse mackerels. Way too many horse mackerels. I ain't gonna get them. Let's go to our campsite. Let's finish off at my campsite. And you can see what's changed. It's a very mild change. But since we've completed all the Christmas items. I decided to craft up a few different things. I say a few different things. A few things that are exactly the same. Let's go with that. Because that's way more true than a few different things. Travel to your friend's campsite. Oh, look at the snowy trees, man. This is the first time I'm seeing this. Just seeing it with me. The snowy trees. Some of you guys might not have the trees yet. Or the snow yet. Uh, because you wait till it's the 11th in your time zone. But look at this. Look at the snow. Run, little bare feet. I love when my guy still looks like he's going to bed. He's ready for bed. And we have the pool, obviously, you've seen the pool. The carousel was here, we can actually add the carousel if you want to see it, like you haven't seen it before. But man, I need to see this, the snowman actually blends in now. Everything looks good, everything looks great. And the addition was this pile of presents, the gigantic pile of presents, which let's craft another set. Why the heck not, right? We've got 50 hours on our stage, God damn it. We'll craft another pile of presents, a mountain of presents, not a pile of presents, it's a mountain. It's even bigger than Pal. That'll be done in a minute. We'll have a quick little chat to a few people. Uh, but we'll add our um, carousel in there. But we'll see if we can get some essence. So everybody here is cool because I need a cool essence for my stage. So I cooked everyone out. And I needed like, I, need, I think I needed six cool essence. So we were out yesterday. And I had a little, little break, sit down for a minute. And I need a cool essence. Oh, you're sporty. Okay, bud. I mistook you for cool. I needed six cool lessons. Put all the cool characters in my campsite, chatted them up, and do you know what I got? Six cool lessons. That's the, like the equivalent of going to a non-yellow quarry and getting essence. It was awesome. It was fantastic. When they give you bells, it makes me want to kick them out. Sandy. No, I'm not. I'm not talking about just you, Sandy. It's not just you. When they give you bells, doesn't that just tick you off when they're like, oh, here, here's something for you. And you're like, yes, here it comes, here it comes. I'm overflowing with these right now. So I thought I'd see if you could use any. And it's going to be, at least it's not bells, steel. I actually sold some steel because I hit max steel. So I had to drop it down. Sold a few, made like a thousand bucks or something. Apollo is sleeping in the pool. How did he get there? He probably flew. Oh, Rom, you've done really well. You've really done it with this pool. Yeah, thank you, man. You know that your campsite is going to be filled with screaming kids all year long, right? How does he know what's in my camper? Have you been looking in my camper? And I'll be one of them. Ha 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 ha. He don't know what I'm talking He don't know what's going on. He's cool. He's cool. He's all right. It was just a mistake. Just a, just a little mistake. Nothing, nothing weird. How's it going? Here, take this. Oh, look at that. I got your beetles, man. Don't ask for horse mackerels, because there are none. They're extinct. They're all extinct, apparently. You know what you need to do? You need to go up a level and put me on level 49. I haven't seen skill like that since the days of a young Apollo. I don't know why, but I picture Apollo as like Obi-Wan. Ga ha ha, I kid, you're the best. Oh, level 13. If we, I think if we get one more, we will actually get to level 50. Let's see. Oh, actually, no, probably two more. I would say two more. 
Could be one, but I'd, I'm I'm thinking two. What's the latest, Pa? Tell me a story. Tell me a tale. Man, this place is really buzzing. You've done a great job, kiddo. Out of all the campsites I've seen, this could be the best one yet. Pa! I always thought he called me like Pa, like a cow, like a kid in a cowboy movie. Pa, Pa! But he just seems to say Pa. Uh, points to next level two, so we need to level up two more animals, and we will be level fifty. Nice round level fifty. Got some news, Rob? What's the latest? I like that she asked me if I've got news, and then I ask her immediately after, "What's the latest?" Uh, apparently, he's the one to blame for this chilly weather we've been having lately. And what, what? Huh? If I ever find that guy, I'll get so heated he may even melt. They're giving us new conversations. I should be reading these. Cool lessons. I'll take it. We got now. We now we have a total of two cool lessons in our inventory. Oh yeah. All right. Let's see what they, if they if they've changed up their dialogue for the season. That's good. What's the what? Snuffle. Oh you. Oh don't tell me you want you want horse mackerel, don't you? Hey hey, check this out for a second. I've got something for you. Think nothing of it. These things are piling up all over my place. But not be bells. Oh good. Essence. Cotton. Cotton. That ain't bad. That ain't bad. Essence. Essence is better. Our present. Our, our mountain of presents are done. Angus, what's up, buddy? What's the latest, Macmu? Tell me a story. Tell me the tale of your people. I don't know about you, but I don't have the patience for crafting these days. I'm too old for patience. That's why I use leaf tickets. You're not selling me with your commercial, man. I ain't buying no leaf tickets. I don't need my, no leaf tickets. Cut to two weeks later when the New Year's event's around. I don't have enough leaf tickets to make everything. I betcha. I betcha that's what I'm going to be doing. Bet you they're gonna get me. They're gonna, they're gonna hit up my bank account, and I'm gonna be like, oh, I bought digital leaf tickets so I could have digital furniture. And then Mel is gonna be like, you idiot! You could have bought a couch in real life. We need a couch. We don't need a couch. But I don't, she could say that, and I'll be like, you're totally right. Why did I buy leaf tickets? What the hell is a leaf ticket? Imagine trying to explain that to somebody. They'll be like, oh, why are you so poor? What did you spend your money on? How can I avoid it? I'm like, I bought leaf tickets. They would be like, what the hell are you talking? What the hell is a leaf ticket? Are you high? You want drugs? I'm like, no, I bought leaf tickets so I could buy furniture. For animals. They'd be so confused. They would, I'd be committed. I would be straight up committed. And they'd be like, they'd be like the leaf tickets are real. You don't understand. The animals, they're waiting for me. Oh yeah, buddy. Whatever. All right, let's play some more presents. Just pile this place up with presents, because I'm a generous guy. I'm gonna place the presents. I'm gonna put them... I guess here. I guess here. Let's turn them around. There we go. Let's put them there. Actually, no. I don't like that. There we go. That's better. Wanted to be a little bit different. And we'll place... We'll place this. Why the hell not, right? It's gigantic. Is the, the, is the game working out where to put it? Where to put it? The game's like, I don't know where to put that, man. That's... That, that's... That can't go... Oh, don't grab the cake. That thing can't go anywhere. Where shall we put this? Why the fire is not too bad? But does that give us a clear path to run through? Got up picking the cake up, fat fingers. I do not have fat fingers, by the way. It's just like, if it, there we go. Okay, so our path is gonna be blocked completely. So I'm gonna get rid of this. Even though it's very Christmassy. I'm gonna put a little KK here. I'll put that there. I'm gonna move this. Apparently, if I hold this, there we go. As a solid tick, tip, Pocket Camp Pro gives that little tip holding the table. So yeah, because you know when you try to grab everything, you're like ah, if you just hold it. So grab, hold, it'll grab the table. That is the best tip that anyone's ever given me in my entire life. That's how many tips I get. I don't get many tips. All right, we're gonna put the cat tower somewhere, somewhere where cats would enjoy it. I guess there. That's a terrible spot for it. I agree. It's a lousy spot. It's an awful spot. No one's going to use it. No cat's going to want that. Uh, maybe... I'm going to move this. I'm going to move this over. I'll put the cat towel there. Put it next to the lamp. There we go. How beautiful. How nice. How wonderful. How quaint. Perfect. Let's grab this again. Put that there. There we go. We uh, have a, a little bit of a path. It's kind of like a... Just go around some stuff, but that's okay. That's fine. 
I accept. Save it. Uh, we'll add our carousel now, because that's what I said I would do. I want to keep my word. And we don't want kids running around screaming at this place. So we'll put our carousel back in. I've seen a maxed out carousel. It's awesome. It's got balloons and stuff on it. It looks fantastic. We'll get there one day. One day we'll get there. We're going to work on our treehouse first. Actually, we'll work on whatever the hell we can, really, honestly. Uh, but, like, because the next upgrade, like, level 2 to 4, takes 0 seconds, we're probably going to have nothing in the amenity slot for a long time, because we're going to... It's a lot of essence. It's a crap ton of essence to get. Uh, but there's our carousel. How nice. How fun is this? Got these Christmas presents everywhere. All the animals are going to be happy. We've got a snowman sitting by the fire. We got Roscoe switching on the lamp. Good job, buddy. Making sure that still works. I thank you for it. Even though it's quite annoying. And KK is playing to Bud, who's trying to read a book. Sandy's having some cake. Kyle's over here having a freak out, I don't know, breakdown of some kind. But thank you guys so much for watching today's Animal Crossing snow filled video. Finally, the snow is here. That's what we've been waiting for. I will see you. When I see you, I'm going to do my best to keep these daily. Uh, we're in that busy time of year, but I'm going to do my absolute best to make sure that I come back every day to tell you what's going on, what's the what, to talk about singing and whatnot. But enjoy your day. If I don't see you, or you don't see me, or don't hear me, I can't actually see you. If I could, that would be incredibly weird. Uh, but if you don't see my videos, just be patient. We'll get them when we get them. Oh, <laughs> my